Cancer, this is your 2022 career slash finance reading. Okay, so make sure you hit the subscribe button because I am doing all things 2022 this month and you're going to want to get notified when I upload content for you, specifically Cancer. Okay, and also check out my Instagram because I have started to do some candle magic. So if you're interested in doing... um like a little ceremony or having something like that done for you to increase your energy for 2022 since we're coming up to that, check out my Instagram, broken underscore tarot, I'm sorry, broken underscore wing underscore tarot at Instagram. Okay. Also, there will be an extended for this, and in the extended, I'm going to go over uh, advice, timeline, blockages, and things you're not seeing. So I'll pull some oracle cards, and we'll hop right into your tarot reading. Uh, definitely check out your moon rising and Venus signs to get a bigger picture of what's going on for 2022 for you. Okay, Enchanted Forest, Mystery, Magic, and Excitement, Cancer. So this is your finance reading. Sacred Heart, Passion, Love, Spiritual Communion. These two. Sacred Mother, A Message of Love. See the hearts here? I feel like there's something about following your heart. And what you're not seeing is intuitive communication, silent whispers of the heart. Interesting. Mystery, magic, excitement. There's hearts on um, all of them. There's hearts on all of them. There's something about following your heart, following your destiny, following... Whatever it is you, you do for 2022, it needs to be done with love. Page of Wands, Queen of Swords, standing in your truth. This is some sort of like gently cutting through the bullshit. Waking up. I feel like there might be a different direction that you might be taking. Being truthful about the past. See how both of these are looking? The Queen of Swords is looking in the past and the Awakening is looking towards the future. Knight of Swords, Three of Cups, Seven of Pentacles, and the overall energy for the reading is the Tower. Okay. I feel like there's an idea or there is something you really want to take action with. There's like, you know, it might have been something. It could be something like cryptocurrency. It's like something from the past that you wanted to invest in. Something you wanted to, that you looked at when you were younger. Maybe it was stocks. Maybe it was bonds. Maybe it was cryptocurrency. It was something that, that you've always wanted to take action into like investing in or take action into doing and you never had the money or you were never able to or it, it wasn't possible for you to do it. And I feel like you might have just enough saved to be able to like do what it is that you want to do. It's something like you know, you know, it could be something along the lines of like um, creating something to help with the pandemic. There's a service or, you know, find a need, fill a need. There's something like that going on. But it happens all of a sudden. It's like now or never. I feel like there might be a friend or several friends that are like, hey, you know what? We've invested in this and it's been beneficial. I feel like, I feel like you're going to be able to have guidance in this. It could even be people from work. It doesn't necessarily have to be friends. <clears throat> it's almost like your past and your future collide. There's something to do with like your past and your future collide. It's like some sort of skill or experience that you've had in the past you're able to use to be able to create more money in the future. Or it's like the skill that you have over here that's making a lot of money, you're able to take that and like put it over here and it's able to make money here and it's able to make money here. But it's like you have it, you have it so that you've like automated this system. 
you've been able to do everything and like it's like the the rules and the system that you've created over here is like universal for multiple different things so it's almost like you create a class and you're able to sell this, this system this idea it's something along those lines of whatever it is that you've learned in the past you're able to actually make money in the future you know, like the skill that you learned with stocks and bonds, maybe it helps with cryptocurrency. I don't know. I don't know anything about that stuff. But, I mean, it's something along those lines that you've wanted to do for, for a while. And a friend is like, it's, it's a system of operations. Everything has a, an operational process. <clears throat> I was a wedding photographer for many years. And people are like, oh, my God, that must have been difficult. Mm hmm all weddings have the pretty much the same thing getting ready bride and groom and then it's like either a you have the first look or b you go straight into the ceremony so then you have the ceremony and then the family photos after like these are like standard things that like always happened in the process of a wedding like there is a specific process that everything goes through a standard operating process so it's like once you have the standard operating process for this specific system you're looking at it and you can actually incorporate it into another system and you're like, oh my gosh, I could turn this into a class or uh, maybe not even a class, but maybe a, a, an outline or something that you can sell to make more money. So it's like this over here that you've learned in the past, you're able to make money off of it in the future. Teaching it, able to teach it showing people it's something that is like it comes out of nowhere i do feel like that whatever it was while it happens all of a sudden the information that you learned was not something that was learned overnight it has taken a long time for you to be able to create what it is that you're doing right now but i feel like like there's like another job opportunity or like another business that you want to start and it's like Yes, this business is so different or this situation is so different, but the operating process is the same. You know, there are like specific things that always happen, but while they're different, it's like you're able to unite your past and your future, which is really awesome because it's like you already have everything you need to be able to make money twice. You're like able to double dip. It's like this... And it happens all of a sudden, like you're sitting there and like you're talking with your friends or you're over dinner or you're talking with a coworker, and they're like, oh, you know, well, this business over here or this situation over here would be great if you could invent this or create this. And it's like we could. So it's like you could be expanding the business that you already have. Or it could be something completely different or you're selling something, but whatever whatever it is, I do see that you will be making additional money more towards the end of 2022. Like double, like double what you're making. Okay, so in the extended, I'm gonna go over timeline advice, blockages, and things that you're not seeing. Don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, and share button so that way you can get notified because of all this stuff I'm doing for 2022. Also, a couple of videos are going to pop up here. If the title resonates for you, I highly recommend you check them out, and I will see you over there.